Thank you. All right, we are back live out here at NRG after this big Texans win over the Patriots. And if you've ever been to a Texans game, you've probably never seen one with a retractable, retractable rather, roof open. It has a lot of fans wondering, does it even work anymore? And if it does work, why is it never open? Well, our Mario Diaz with the investigators is on the case. Sunroof. It's great to have it. A testament to automotive ingenuity. If I don't have to worry about my hair looking good, I love that thing open. When one is joined with Mother Nature on the inside. The wind, the sun, the whole bit, it's great. Pressure is simply applied. Glass smoothly retracts. The journey filled with symphonic automotive engineering. Slowly building to the moment when open air is fully exposed. It's kind of like having a little bit of convertible, but like not totally. <laughs> so it might add a few more dollars to the monthly note. However, Houstonians sure don't seem to mind. We've seen it time and time and time again all over the city where people have their roofs wide open. In fact, who out there wouldn't take advantage of this luxury amenity, especially after making such a costly investment? Oh yeah, that's right, the Texans. <laughs> The Texans keep the roof closed Thursday night. They are organizational losers. For several seasons now, the airwaves have been filled with discussion over NRG's retractable roof. You know, we have picture-perfect weather outside, but the roof is closed. Challenging, though, for many to recall the last time it was open for a Texans game. You have been to every single home game since day one. Absolutely. When was the last time they had the roof open? I don't even know. <laughs> I don't know why they don't. They don't open it up more. Complete coverage comes naturally for superfan Red Mysterio. I know it must be kind of hard to watch the action with all of this. But even he has questions. Mr. Mysterio, have you ever wondered about the mystery as to why they keep this roof closed all the time? I wonder. I wonder, yeah. So do fans who fashion the garb of Houston's gridiron past. Would the Oilers have opened the roof more often? Yep, they would and made all that sound still go in. Channel 2 investigates examined the four other NFL franchises with retractable roofs to see how the Texans stack up. The roof is open, the windows are open here at Lucas Oil Stadium. 27 times since 2008 for the Indianapolis Colts, including eight since 2015. The Dallas Cowboys, 22 games since 2009. The Atlanta Falcons have had their roof open eight times since they started operations two seasons ago. Stadium officials in Arizona revealed their roof has been open 102 times since 2015 for a variety of events, including Cardinals games. As for the Texans, the last game where they had the roof open was November 30th, 2014. Keep in mind, nearly 450 million public dollars from tourists, stadium users, and tenants was utilized to build NRG. Can you open her up? Sure. All right, close her again. But to see a retractable cover on game day, well, fans are better off crossing paths with tailgating chefs like Robert Garcia. So you have a pretty good retractable system here. Yes. What about that stadium behind you? I'm pretty sure they got one where they just push a button and it'll rope right up within 20, 30 minutes. Channel 2 Investigates did reach out to NRG stadium officials to see the actual button or computer system that opens the roof. They denied our request, signing security reasons. As for whether or not it actually still works? Oh, yeah, it works. This from Ed Emmett, former Harris County judge and KPRC's political analyst. It's my understanding that they've made the choice that the crowd noise is worth more to them than the open air. The Texans' Nick Martin agrees. I don't know. I guess the physics of it, I think the sound like stays in more, so it definitely helps out our defense. Teammate Brendan Scarlett feels the continuity of game time conditions provides an edge. We get to play in all our home games in 72 degree weather, perfect conditions, which I would call that an event. Longtime Texans fan Leo Ramirez had this take on the consistent closures. To each his own, but I mean, if you have it, use it. 
You know, I mean, I'm not going to buy a, a convertible and not take off the top. We'll have a sunroof. Exactly. Absolutely. You're absolutely right. Which means, at least for now, local fans may have to go to creative extremes if they want to watch the Texans play under an open roof. A global mapping and data company recently ranked the top 10 loudest stadiums in the NFL. And interestingly, only four of the top 10 are dome or retractable roof stadiums. The other six are all outdoor stadiums. Now you might be wondering, is NRG one of them? You can find out by checking out the full list right now in the investigates section of click2houston.com. Mario Diaz, Channel 2 Investigates. Mm, I guess ours served as more of a moon